what has taken him so long. Look, I don't care which kitty cancer fundraiser it is. I'm not doing it unless I get my 20%. Hey, Lois. Hey, Superman. Are you ready for your interview? Yeah. First question. What is the absolute best part about being Superman? Hmm. Wow. That's a tough one. There's a lot of perks, you know. But I would have to say... <laughs> what? So, you want to join the real Mile High Club? Put me down, you creep! Sorry, sweetheart. There's only one way off this ride. Yeah, that's the one. Your favorite part about being Superman is that you can abduct helpless women off the street and force them to have sex with you? No, 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 no. I don't force anyone. That would be wrong. I strongly suggest. Besides, most chicks are dying to ride the super shaft. That's despicable. Next question. What's the worst part about being Superman? I would definitely have to say all of the pressure. It's like when you're Superman, everyone expects you to have all the answers. So many people look to me for guidance. It's like John Lennon said. I'm bigger than Jesus. As a man of pressure, let me Arrogant bastard. You really screwed me this time, Lois. Responsibility? Don't give me that crap. I got dropped from a kitty cancer fundraiser because of you. Well, sorry's don't pay the bills, Lois. Jesus! You got that right, butthole. I'll text you later. Listen, buddy. I don't care who your daddy is. No one talks to me like that. Look here, pretty boy. I am the shepherd of mankind. Look. That was taken out of context. Liar! You've been usurping me ever since you hit puberty. Church attendance started hitting the shitter worldwide the second you started flying around. That's not my fault. Maybe if you weren't such a hermit all the time. Come around once in a while, you know? Walk on some water. <laughs> or cure some leprosy. <laughs> What the hell are you laughing at? I'm nothing. It's just that I can melt semi-trucks with my eyeballs. <laughs> you really think you're better than me, don't you? Well, you're gonna burn in hell. You wish. Kryptonians are not under your jurisdiction. Shut up. All right, here's how the cookie's going to crumble. You're going to fly away, and you're not going to come back. And how is a skinny Jewish pacifist going to make Superman do anything? I'll torment you forever. You can't hurt me. Hey, what are you doing? Poking ya. And I'm not going to stop till you leave. You're joking. I don't joke. And I've got all eternity. Stop it. That's getting irritating. You'll quit before I do.
can't be. No! Ah. How's that for a power super douchebag? That's one of the perks when you're a manager of a heaven. Your daddy got you that job anyway. Stop it. I'll, I'll leave. I can't take it anymore. I can't kill you again. I'll, I'll leave tonight. So, we all set? <laughs> yeah. Just taking one last look at home. Hey, buck up now. <laughs> last time you were forced to flee your home planet, things turned out great. I don't see why you care so much. Care about what? About whether or not these people worship you. Because they need to learn right from wrong. Good luck. I'm down there every single day. They're a bunch of wild animals. Nothing has changed since they nailed you up on that cross. They're killing and enslaving each other more efficiently than ever before. I try to get them to love each other. But they don't, do they? That's because they think the whole world was made just for them. And they think they can do whatever they want with everything else on the planet. Most of them only want to fuck fight, or go shop. They're not going to get any better. Hmm. Dad, help me. They're not. I got crucified for nothing. Maybe you wouldn't mind sticking around and helping me take care of something. 